I've had the privilege to be around a few successful people and I can tell you, regardless of all of those physical things, there is a peace that only God, he said, peace I give you, my peace. There is the type you can get when you build a house. Congratulations. There is a type you can get when you go to school. There is a type you can get when you have children. But there is a kind of peace only God gives. He said, my peace I give to you, not as the world gives anyone who claims to have that peace without jesus is lying my highest definition of success is peace more than progress more than achievements peace there are many people today who will pile up their achievements like a rubble and set it on fire in search for peace the peace of god is a gift you can sit in the midst of storms and laugh by an agency ordinary human beings cannot explain he said the lord is my light and my salvation of whom shall i be afraid of one of the proofs that you have met the son is peace that is peace in your heart you see this this running around that people do around life hey, hey there is nothing that is truly an emergency when you have the peace of god because you are assured that even in life and in death you are victorious but you see many times when we save people we miss the peace part I know you are saved not just that i check i cannot see that righteousness it's a gift and it's spiritual but i can see the peace of god in you peace is not carelessness he makes me to lie down in green pastures because you are already crucified with christ and it is appointed for men to die once and if you are you are dead once already the devil will not trouble you again the peace of God that surpasses all understanding is, is in a realm that is higher than understanding so someone looks at you and says you are stupid because the peace of God is in you it secures you you, you are not looking to prove a point to say look I, I will show you I'm no 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 that is that is the life of one who does not have the Son the security that that peace gives you gives you rest just to let you know that your salary will not come this month and that trouble wants to come and the peace of god says go to bed if god is awake and you are awake who is leading who if he's awake sleep he is called the keeper not just the owner of israel the keeper of israel that's a language of responsibility everybody say i have peace prophesy to every trouble say i have peace for god's sake there are people who continue to die did you know i say it humorously sir you know bp and high blood pressure used to be something for people maybe in their 50s or 60s but now you see someone 20 21 having high blood pressure because there is a manipulation satan is manipulating this system and robbing us of the value of peace we give up our peace in a heartbeat searching for mundane things let me tell you if you have ever asked what do i have that a non-believer does not have if it's a house you lied if it's education you lied let me tell you one thing that they do not have the peace of god that surpasses all understanding so you walk out of this place today feeling happy knowing that i may not have all the money in the world but i have peace the peace of god and peace with god there are two different things i have peace with god that i know that if my life evaporates from this realm is only a door that opens to a place of rest according to the authority of scripture so i am not i i do not move as though i do not have a future and a destiny no i serve his purposes and if for any reason i exit this life you tell people don't weep like those who do not have hope because to be absent in the body is to be present with the lord peace <laughs> the peace of god many believers do not have peace i tell you this many people do not have peace lack of peace has broken marriages and they think the cause is is the spouse they are looking for something neither of them can give themselves it's only the prince of peace that can give that and 
this life is in his son is god helping us tonight that whosoever had the son had that life if 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 we stop here tonight you have learned something that you can walk out of this place with peace you can stand and the bills are staring at you you can stand and the sickness they say there is something yes you will trust god for healing but not by worrying there is peace that i know that the worst of it is still victory for me peace oh believers we need to grow up there is what the world cannot give the world can give you land the world can give you permission to build the world can give you secular education hear me the world can give you promotion they can give you awards but there is one thing that no market can sell there is one thing that no bank can keep there is one thing that no security system can guard it's called the peace of god administered by the prince of peace himself will never find me by the grace of God Almighty putting my hand on my chin and saying life oh no oh no I already know the worst that can happen to men is called death and the Bible says oh death where is your sting do you know what that means hold on do you know what that means that like like the like the sting of a of a what they call that of a scorpion you see that now it has lost its power because death is two things one it can be doom for someone or number two it can be an entrance a door that leads to another realm they are all called death it is within your power to choose which one by that death I, I don't just mean cessation of life I mean transition to another reality they are all called death please find peace tonight we worry too much we have given the devil plans where is my child now what what if they destroy him what uh -uh, the keeper of israel that child is only alone to you no matter how responsible you are there, there are limits to which you can you learn to rest enter your sabbath my soul find rest lord i know that i need my child's school fees tomorrow otherwise i will be in trouble and i it's human to be afraid and to think but later on just remember hey i'm a christian i'm not irresponsible if you being evil know how to give good gifts lord i rest in the conviction that you are abba my source my sustainer and my defender let your jealousy vindicate me even within this time let me tell you this the bible says stand still and then you will know there is an information about god that only being still brings stand still and you will know that i am god if you can't be still you will not see that dimension stand still i know the rent issue is before you but stand still ladies and gentlemen i am not stupid i'm a human being too i know that sometimes it's difficult to stand still before certain things the medical report the issue the backlash from your family members have not seen the benefit of your christianity you are just praying vigils upon vigils you've been praying for vigils vigils no child no husband no wife no this no money and sometimes you feel stupid for being a child of god but i bring you good news the prince of peace is still on the throne and let me tell you he knows how to administer that peace the peace of god is not just emotional comfort is that he resolves all the things that must make sure the turbulence in your mind goes away so that you can have true rest are we blessed